Mihir was a conscientious student um, who was respectful and engaged in class. Um, we know that Mihir attended school on a regular basis um, and participated fully in the classes here at Victoria Park. 15-year-old Mahir Dasani has now been identified as the victim of a triple stabbing that happened here on the track at Victoria Park Collegiate yesterday afternoon. And now the entire school community is grieving the loss of the grade 11 student in a stabbing that also injured two other students from the school. There is no worse circumstance for us as educators. Uh, so many of us are caregivers in our lives and so we can appreciate uh, what Mahir's family, the family of the injured students, must be feeling and thinking right now, and our hearts are with them. A police drone captured images this morning above the field where the altercation occurred shortly after classes were let out for the day. A letter sent to parents says that it was staff who called 911, and when police arrived, two boys were suffering from stab wounds on the field. A third victim was later found in a nearby apartment. Investigators say Dasani was stabbed in the torso and was pronounced dead in hospital. It's really scary. Yeah, it's unbelievable because this I. And uh, this happened in the campus. 19 year old Ahmed Raffin has now been charged with second degree murder in connection to the fatal stabbing. The TDSB says the suspect is a former TDSB student but had never attended Victoria Park Collegiate. It's pretty scary and like kind of traumatizing. It was a really scary incident too. And I wish nothing like that happens again. The stabbing has shocked many in the city. Mayor John Tory tweeting this morning, it is heartbreaking to know a 15-year-old boy died after a stabbing at Victoria Park Collegiate. On behalf of all of the people of the City of Toronto, I extend deepest condolences to his family and friends and the entire school community. We know there was a big group that witnessed what happened. There was a big group of staff uh, that, was, that was involved in assisting. So today is all about a team that's here already of social workers who provide grief counseling and support. While there are cameras on school property, homicide detectives are still reaching out to anyone who may have taken pictures or video before, during or after the incident yesterday. A link can be found on our website to upload those pictures for police. That's toronto.citynews.ca. In North York, Tammy Sutherland, City News.